Okay, uh, this technique uh, is a blood on a blood agar chapter 525, and it's called a streak, called a streak step technique. Uh, because the technique is uh, to isolate the two types of uh, uh, hemolysin. So hemolysin, streptolysin O is an austin label, which is an austin unstable. So that means the one bacteria grew with austin and uh, this type of toxin would be, uh, would be uh, degraded, I mean unstable. And the second, the streptolysin S is an austin stable. So that can uh, that, that can uh, function can be functional in the presence of austin when when a bacteria in the on a, a aerobic growth. So to generate anaerobic growth, we need a step. Okay, use use this loop. Okay, let me see here. Okay, use the loop. Okay, loop right. Yeah, so here, you uh, use a, a vertically. You touch the bacteria first, right? and vertically step into the agar, deep to the bottom, deep to the bottom of the agar. So then you will pull them out, so that will generate, the, then you will bring the bacteria into the agar, deep into the agar. So when you pull it out, the, the gap may, may be closed, so that will generate a low oxygen environment, allow the, uh, allow the, the S type of uh, um, hemolysis be generated and functional. So, uh, so in the end, I put them here, I forgot to say it, to say it. So in the end, you, um, so in a, in, a, in a full sector plate, you touch the bacteria, you step in here, Point them out, then you, you do your streaking over here. And you do the four, four of them, four of them, right? And for the mouse, you use a toothpick, right? You use a toothpick to step into it and uh, slide a little bit more. And so next week, you can see a strip of growth with a hemolysis. Why not? Yeah. And for this, you do the same thing. You, you make a you streak, a uh, step here, step here, then you do streaking. Anybody? Yeah, for my country, you don't need to do that because this is for so a special type of um, hemolysis. Okay, yeah, sorry, sorry for the missing this part.